Hello everyone, um, I'm excited to welcome you to the October episode of My Anzisha Chain. As the year comes to a close, it's a perfect time to reflect on the impact we are leaving behind, not just in our businesses, but in our communities and the world at large. Um, today I'll be talking about the topic of impact that I want to leave on my community and the steps that I'm taking to make that vision work. A reality. So first of all, I say impact is the heart and soul of entrepreneurship. Uh, it's about going beyond profits and then creating a positive change. It is the legacy we leave behind, the lives we touch, and the solutions we provide to real world problems. It's a powerful force that shapes not just our ventures but the world around us. A vision for my community is that um, I envision a community that's stronger, more empowered, and then uplifted by my contributions. That's, um, that's, it's about addressing the needs and then the challenges faced by people around me and then creating solutions that enhance their lives. Um, in part, it's about making a difference on a personal level. As such, uh, looking at uh, areas of influence, um, I aspire to leave a long lasting impact. That is to identify areas where our skills, our resources, and our passions intersect with the needs of our community. Whether it's through job creation, through education, through uh, environmental sustainability, or any other avenue focusing on these areas that allows us to channel our efforts effectively. And so, talking about creating a sustainable change. Um, it's not just about the short-term fixes. It's about creating solutions that have reform effects over time. Uh, whether it's true innovative business models or partnerships, the aim is to create a change that endures beyond our uh, immediate involvement. And so um, I will also talk about collaboration for greater impact. Uh, since together we can do more. And so uh, that is how I wrap up on my episode on leaving a lasting impact to my society, my entrepreneurship journey. Thank you.